Her name is Jun and Kyung. She born in July 9, 1965. She graduating from Jeonnam Girls High School and entrance into a Seoul National University Medical School. After graduation Seoul National University she went to Seoul National University Graduate School of Health and Seoul National University Graduate School of Medicine. In 1994, she started to work on hospital. In there she establishes standards for reporting infectious diseases. And in 1998, she became an epidemiological investigator at the National Institutes of Health in Korea. In 2000, Jun Yoon Kyung helped to get vaccinated against measles, and in 2006, sure, help prevent blood accidents caused by the AIDS virus. In 2009, she was the head of the disease policy department and responded to the swine flu. After that, she was emergency medical manager. But in 2014, she moved to Korea Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and being the head of the Korea Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Due to COVID-19, which began in Wuhan, Hubei Province, China in November 2019, the first confirmed case was appearing in Korea in 2020. So every 2 p.m., Jun Yun Kyung briefed how to prevention COVID-19. Later, at the briefing on February 10, 2020, she expressed her position that she would decide after monitoring a little more, not in the stage of expanding the entry ban. KCDC said Jun Yun Kyung is always guarding the KCDC emergency room, except for sleeping time. She don't have that much time because she needs to attend for video conferencing. Preparation for a briefing for 2 p.m. She just ate some packed lunch, get thinner and thinner. February 25, 2020, she cut her hair short. She said, there's no time to wash my hair. One reporter asked Jun Yun Kyung, there's a rumor that you can only sleep for an hour in a day. How long do you sleep in a day? Jun Yun Kyung said, I sleep more than an hour. On March 21, the U.S. Bloomberg newspaper nicknamed Jun Yun Kyung, Virus Hunter. On April 3, WSJ mentioned Jun Yun Kyung in an article introducing real heroes who did not put themselves up in the COVID-19 incident. July 23, 2020, she took two days off for the first time. It was the first day off after 186 days of work without weekend since the outbreak of COVID-19 on January 19. However, on the 23rd and 24th she couldn't take a break because of the meeting. She rested completely from the evening of 24th to the morning of the 25th. On January 22, Jun Yun Kyung announced that she is currently considering going to school in the lower grades of elementary school. On May 8, 2021, she visited the immunization center in Arundong, Sejong Si, for Parents' Day. In summer, the number of confirmed patients increased due to the mutation of the COVID-19 and began to record for digits. On July 8, the number of confirmed cases reached 1,275, and Jun Yun Kyung said at a briefing that failure to respond quickly could increase Saito, 2130 a day in two weeks. The end.